Hey guys, I wanted to do a quick little video here. Season four reloaded is here. The season four mid-season update is officially here. Uh, it'll be, I think, on the 12th. So that's Wednesday, today's Monday. So a couple days we'll actually have it. So I went through and read all the patch notes, uh, basically the pre-patch notes um, to kind of go over, you know, what, what new stuff so you didn't have to take time and hop in and read all this. I'll hit all the, the most important parts. So as we're kind of looking over this map here, you'll kind of see some of the things, some new camos, a new field upgrade, some, uh, you know, some, the Vondel is actually a, going to be a battle royale mode. So that's pretty exciting. There's a new gulag for Vondel, um, and some other new field upgrades and, and some stuff like that. We won't really be touching on any multiplayer stuff or any DMZ stuff, mainly all Warzone things here. So um, just kind of starting at the top. Uh, going down, you'll kind of see that The Boys, which is a new movie or TV show or something that I haven't ever watched, uh, but it is that's one of the themes. So there's a lot of new uh, operators and stuff that are related to that, and new packs coming out. Um, there is the new, you know, as I mentioned, the new Battle Royale for Vondel. Pretty excited, you know. It's it's been a previously best been a resurgence map, but now it's going to be a Battle Royale map with a Gulag that you'll go to. 72 players looks like. So that'll be really fun to give a try out. Quads, trios, duos, and solos playlist will be for that. Um, there is a new Gulag as well. Very excited about that. Unfortunately, it's only for the uh, Vondel map. So that's kind of sad. Um, maybe they'll bring it to Warzone, Almazra later. Um, you know, I'm excited to see that new, try out this new Gulag. Hopefully they bring it to Almazra because, you know, I, I think a lot of us are ready for a new, new Gulag. Not excited about the one we're using now. Um, there is a new rotation for uh, Resurgence. So they're going to be flip-flopping back between Ashika and Vondel back and forth. And uh, so maybe this signifies something exciting. Maybe they'll start doing some uh, more map rotations with the larger maps eventually. That'd be kind of cool. Maybe they're testing this out to see how it goes. Um, we'll kind of see how we'll kind of see how that works out and and uh, go from there. So um, also the occupation scan or I don't know if you remember this in Rebirth Island, if you remember playing that where there'd be a scan that'd go out, you'd have to go prone for it happened, or you'd be highlighted red, um, your outline through walls and stuff like that. And I'm not sure if it was on the mini map or not. I can't exactly remember. Um, uh, we do have these new portable redeploy drones. So this is one of the new field upgrades, pretty exciting. Fortunately, it's only with Vondel again. So maybe they're just kind of testing it out here. Um, but yeah, it'd be cool to have a, you know, a redeploy drone that you can throw down real quick and your team can shoot somewhere. Um, you know, so kind of like the, the portable buy stations. So may, I'm not sure if you'll be able to shoot these down or not. I guess we'll see. Uh, probably you can shoot them down just like the other ones. I don't know if you'll be able to shoot them down before they get there or how that's going to work. Um, going through some of this stuff, skipping a lot of that. Uh, new weapons. So there is a new shotgun weapon coming out, um, the MX Guardian. So pretty excited about this. Always excited for new weapons. It does sound like it's going to be like a little bit like the KV broadside, maybe even better than the KV broadside. So um, we'll see. That was kind of fun to use. Um, you know, it, I mean, it can be kind of cheesy, but who knows? We'll give it a shot, right? It's always fun to try new weapons and see about that. Uh, in order to unlock this, I don't know if you remember, but there is this spot on the battle pass that is classified, right? And if you look at it today, it'll say one day remaining um, on the classification. And so it looks like what it's going to be is it's going to be that fifth slot, probably that shotgun. You got to unlock the, the four and then uh, you'll be able to get that shotgun. So just be aware of that. Get the shotgun unlocked as soon as you can. Give it a try. Uh, you know, let me know how you feel about that. Let me know how you think. Um, yes. Yeah, so, um, uh, the other big thing is the new temp V field upgrade, right? So we talked yeah, about these field upgrades. This one's probably going to have a little bit of mixed reviews. Um, it looks like it's going to be some sort of superpower ish stuff. It is say it's temporary. So, you know, we'll see how it goes. Hopefully it's not on there too long. Cause I don't know if I'm going to like it, but you know, maybe there'll be people that are like it and, and give it a shot. So it looks like uh, charge jump, electric shop wave, laser vision and teleport. So the way this is going to work is basically you are going to pick it up as a field upgrade, just like a dead silence or something like that. And it's going to be one of these, one of these five, four random, um, you know, superpowers in, I don't think you'll be able to pick which one it is, but it'll be one of these. Charge jump allows you to kind of move from one place to another a little bit faster. 
you can actually jump on top of somebody and if they're close enough in proximity um, it's going to cause this uh, this splash damage as they call it if you're within a short radius so of that landing spot uh, electric shockwave simply is like a super EMP right so um, you know uh, shut down vehicles and stuff like that equipments uh, laser vision it's gonna allow you to levitate and basically fire this laser beam so we'll kind of see how that plays out uh, and then teleports is gonna basically let you move from one place to another a little bit faster I'm not sure exactly how far from where to where and how you're gonna do it but um, I guess we'll kind of see, see how that goes so um, some new uh, camo weapon challenges so those are kind of exciting hopefully some cool camos will be in there um, the boys operators and stuff so that pretty much covers everything um you know let me know what your thoughts are on this mid-season update it is mid-season so it's not a brand new season so there isn't as much but there are some new things so it'll be pretty cool to kind of see some of that um you know i stream daily on facebook on youtube typically midday uh middle of the day is where i try to start streaming um but thanks for watching don't forget to hit the like button and uh subscribe and we'll catch you on the next one